Hi guys, it's Harvey from All Parts Pool and Spa. I'm in my office and again the phone rang and I got an email. Um, I had a complaint that there's a lot of bugs in the man's pool and he just wanted a, some advice how to keep the bugs out of the pool. A number one, you never want to leave the pool light on during the night. Yes, it looks nice, but it attracts bugs. The other thing is we have a body of water, all right? Can you see my hand? We have a body of water. Usually the jets are here, and the um, top skimmer um, is right here near the top, okay? You don't want to overfill your pool. You want to keep it sort of where it needs to be. There's usually the skimmer tells you where the water level is. He didn't have a weird door, okay? Those annoying weird doors when you jump in the pool, you hear banging and everything. Well, the importance of a weird door is it holds static tension. I know a lot of people think, oh, well, I got a weird door. If I take it off, I can have a lot more flow. What happens, this weird door stays and it holds static tension and it draws the top level of the water towards that skimmer. Yes, the jets and the eyeballs help push it that way, but that weird door keeps that static tension until on top of that pool to draw things to that skimmer, okay? That is why the weird door, you see it just keep moving. It gives the proper flow that the pool wants, but it just, not to repeat myself, helps pull everything to that skimmer basket. So what the man wanted to do is he wanted to get rid of some of those bugs and he ordered the weird door. He's going to call me. I know it'll work. It works all the time. So if you don't have that weird door, you want to replace it. I know it's silly, but if you have bugs and you don't have a weird door, that's why you need that weird door on that. And we're going to show you how to find weird doors, all right? There's universal ones, but we're going to find the proper weird door. So we're going to scroll down. Don't mind my head cocked because I'm looking for skimmers, okay? Because it is a skimmer. We're looking for a pot on a skimmer, all right? And we're going to um, skimmer replacement weirs, but I like going here. I really do. I, I just, um, we'll, we'll go either way, all right? Yeah, everybody knows I pick on Hayward. I'm just a big Hayward fan. It's just, that's me, all right? Pick on Hayward, and you can scroll down. Now we're going to scroll down. Baskets are very important. And guys, you really need your baskets. Your covers, very important. Um, again, um, let's see. So we, you know I do this live. And um, scrolling down. Boy. Here's something else. If you didn't see my other YouTubes, the skimmer plates, skimmer vacs. If you have any kind of trees or dirt and debris, you want to buy these skimmer vacs. They will help put that stuff in the main skimmer basket. You don't pull it out. You use that plate. It'll stop some of your clogging. You really don't want it to go through the pump basket, okay? You want it to go into this basket. These can save you a lot of time and a lot of money. But we'll scroll down and here's your weird doors alright so I recommend replace the weird doors alright and I just I mean, everybody knows I do things live so let's how we'll see how bad I do things um, just wanna show you generic generic skimmer weirs and they're generic, all right? You just got to watch. But, you know, they, they, they fit a lot. They give you 
you know, the Haywood, they give you the dimensions and whatever. So, there's just generic weird doors. Alright. So, I'm going to label this pool and spa weird. Okay. See if we get a lot of um, attention to it. Um, again, we do have um, other brands for weird doors. We got other brands for... Um, I'm just like I said. I'm do I do this live. I just want to see what that is. All right, there's your weird door. Oh, I hate this one. <laughs> I have this on a hot tub. Um, I had to replace. I remember replacing this. All the screws and everything were rusted. I had to get my sawzall. I think it took me like six hours to replace this guy. But the weird door works nice. A little foam plate on it. Um, definitely works nice. I I just don't. Jacuzzi and I do not get along. We just Waterway is another good company. Um, just showing you other pages. I do like Stay Right. Um, so vinyl liner. See what it comes up to. Um, and there's your weird door number six. Let's click on number six, see what it comes up to. Okay, gives you a picture of it. And it's in stock. I just want to show you, and every, I'm proud of this. I really am proud of this. We're going to do this live. I, everybody knows me by now. I go on a tangent. Okay, I always go on tangent. We order one, add it up to our cart. Cart is updated. View cart. All right, go ahead and check out. But there you go, guys. You see me in England or wherever you see me. We can ship worldwide. Click on this puppy and check out. It is that easy to order pool and spa parts. And don't forget, in the next uh, another week and a half, another week and a half, I'm adding like four or five thousand really hard to find products on my website. You know the little wheels for your vacuums, um, poles. Um, you know the your vacuum cleaners for your um, your um, vinyl pools. You know all those little hard to find wheels. I'm adding that. So we're adding we're adding a lot to all parts, pool, and spa. We really are. All right, guys. Again, I am Harvey from All Parts Pool and Spa. Don't forget about the weird doors. They will save you a lot of aggravation as far as bugs and scooping it out every morning. So if you don't have a weird door, um, put one in. Don't forget, May is coming up. My birthday month is May. If any, anybody wants to sell it, send me a birthday present. I really appreciate it. I like birthday presents, you know. Maybe a Porsche 911 if they still have it. You know, um, a Porsche 62-foot um, uh, Blue Water Yacht wouldn't be bad. Just a wish list. All right, guys. Have fun out there. May's coming up. Safety month. I am going to do YouTubes every single day about safety. I am going to drill it into you about CPR and first aid. Do you have a first aid kit near your pool or spa? Do you know CPR? I don't care if you have a pool or a spa. You don't have a pool or spa. You have a body of water, a bathtub, a shower. It only takes about as a half inch of water to drown. It may sound silly. Do you guys know how to do CPR? Do you know, guys, know how to do first aid? Learn it. Put money to Red Cross. Do the Red Cross. Anyway, I'm running on a tangent. Um, and don't forget about um, pool talk. I need to start setting that up. We're going to have fun with pool talk. All right, guys. You take care now. Bye.